Prince and Princess of Wales have decided to separate. The fairy tale, if there ever was one, he is now over. So despite Diana being one of the most famous and most recognizable women in the world, what does she do to cheer up her kids? Well, she did what any mom would do, which is take them to Disney World. My name is Tracy Donaldson, and I was a VIP tour guide at Walt Disney World for Princess Diana and her boys. They flew on British Airways, and we met them on the tarmac. We came directly to the Grand Floridian for them to settle in. My name is Ken Wolf. I was a bodyguard to the late Diana, the Princess of Wales. The Grand Floridian was a luxury hotel within the resort. Diana had an extraordinary suite of rooms. They had spectacular breakfast, a typical American breakfast with Mickey waffles, fruit, bacon, scrambled eggs. I remember William saying, what are those? And Diana said, they're waffles. Don't tell your father about it. We went to the Magic Kingdom, all over with Splash Mountain, and this is one of the attractions that Princess Diana enjoyed, although you can hardly tell, but since that's her, throw her head down. I think she was trying not to get wet. This is Harry and William in the very front. They seem like they're enjoying it tremendously. <laughs> Do musical review, which is a family show, a dinner show. People dressed up in sort of Western cowboy stuff, and William and Harry thought this was fantastic. <laughs> when they asked for volunteers, William's hand went right up and he wanted to participate. We then went back to the Grand Floridian, and uh, I said this was a magical evening, which it was.